Hi everybody, this is Rhys Barber from Audiology Associates. Thank you very much for watching our video today. We have another bilateral earwax removal video for you. So you can see this gentleman's got some uh, quite sticky wax. Not completely blocking the ear canal, but just causing a few issues with uh, with hearing. Using the Jobson horn, you can see a little bit of wax on the Jobson horn because I've used it just to um, probe the wax first of all, just to see how sticky this is. The reason we're opting for the Jobson horn to remove this wax rather than the Zollner tube is because this, the wax is so sticky in nature. When you use a, a Zollner tube, it, it just blocks the end of the Zollner very quickly. So what you have to do is keep clearing the Zollner out a lot and you get a lot more out using the, uh, the Jobson horn. So what I like to do is try and take the central portion of wax away first of all. So create this little valley in the middle and then use the Zollner tube to pull the wax away from the canal walls. You can see it just blocked up very quickly there uh, into the center, just folding the wax in on itself because to take the, the wax away using the, the Jobson horn along the canal wall is, is quite uncomfortable. It, um, it, it feels like a, a mild scraping sensation or mild pinching sensation. So that's why I opt then to use the suction to pull the wax away from the canal walls as it's more comfortable for the patient. You can see just trying to fold it all into the center of the wax. Also trying to loosen it sometimes when you get a grip on, on the sort of base section of wax here and lift it, it will detach quite a bit of it off the canal wall as well. So rather than trying to pull it from the back forwards, which can then stick it to the canal wall as you're going down, we're trying to lift it off and then take it out in a bigger piece. Put some olive oil into the canal there. This just reduces the stickiness of the wax, so it reduces the adhesion to the canal wall. So it does help us to sometimes get this out in one piece. You can see they're just lifting all the wax away, you can see it coming away in slightly bigger pieces now. There we are, I'm just starting to get a little bit of movement. You can see we've unstuck quite a lot of this from the canal wall. Using the suction of the zona now to maneuver this block towards the entrance to the ear canal. It doesn't really want to come out just yet, so we're gonna go See if we can get behind it with the uh, with the Jobson now. Yeah, just sliding, trying to roll. You can see this back section of wax is a lot harder than the front section. So we're able to roll this. You can see little bits of hair in there, which we've seen on quite a few of the videos from ear trims. Here we are. There's that block. So you can see it's quite dark in color. Quite a large piece. And if we take a look then, there we are, there's the uh, eardrum. You can see a little bit of redness around the ear canal there. We've been maneuvering this down. Now, very similar story on the other side. So you can see we've got the, the gap at the top of the wax there. The front end looks quite shiny, so it's always difficult to tell whether that's hardened up or sticky wax. So we're just going to use some suction here. It looks a little bit harder than the, uh, than the other side. So doing the same process again, just trying to lift from the base of the canal. But uh, it doesn't look like it's going to budge. So we're going to use the Jobson now just to get behind this. What you can see is the base of the canal, uh, base of the, the wax nearest the canal walls is quite hardened up, whereas the top is, is very soft and sticky. So we're just going to use the same process. You can see the groove there that the Jobson horns uh, dug into that, uh, that wax there. So we're just going to try and aim for the gap above the wax, not wanting to go in too deep. You can see how sticky that wax is, it's really sticking to the canal as we're trying to maneuver it out. So we're going to use the same process again now, just lifting off the canal wall. There you go, you can just see it starting to move. Okay, going back in with the jobs and honks, it's not quite budging yet. 
this sticky type of wax can be quite frustrating to get out because sometimes it will come out as we saw on the previous year in, in a nice large lump sometimes it starts to break down as we get in there so we've got to keep switching between tools then just to um, use the Zolna rather than to remove the wax um, using it to prepare the wax for the jobs and hold to go in and, and pull that down but you can see we've got a, a slightly harder uh, lump of wax at the, at the base now so we just put a little bit of olive oil in same reason as before just to reduce some adhesion so you can see it's still stuck to the canal walls there and just to help to slide this wax out so if you imagine the olive oil forms almost like a lubrication around the edge of the ear canal as well so not only does it reduce the stickiness but it helps us to um, slide that wax across the skin you can see we've got an end of wax here just protruding from the canal just trying to wrestle this out we broke a little piece off the end we're going to use the jobs and horn to get behind this block now if we can so you can see it's just difficult to get behind it it's just pulling it forward slightly we're just starting to roll now there we go Didn't want to let me pick it up, so we just used the suction to get those pieces away. And there's the eardrum, looking nice and healthy. So this is the wax removed. You can see the first section here, the first piece on the left-hand side, is the larger bit we took out the first year. Uh, so you can see all the bits and pieces there. You can got the jobs and horns, standard size on the tube. You can see some of the bits that got sucked into the suction tube, suction pot as well as we were going. Well, thank you again for watching today, guys. And uh, as if you liked the video, then please share, like, subscribe. And as always, take care.